Hey America, this is the Ninja Pastor, www.blogtalkradio.com backslash the Ninja Pastor and the Ninja Pastor.com, Dr. Sean Greener.com. The new Black Panthers and their supporters are calling for black people to kill white people and white police officers, and they're doing it. They're not just talking about it, they're doing it. Not randomly, but by concerted effort, black people are murdering white people. Better yet, white police officers. That's their target. If they can get a police officer, a white police officer, so much the better. Yet all we hear is these poor young black men can't safely walk the streets because those dirty, racist white police officers are out to murder them. Black people are calling for you to be murdered. The the Black Lives Matter folks are saying white people and even worse, white police officers are to be murdered by black people. You see, black people, uh, for the longest time, have been saying things that simply aren't true. Now, I'm not saying all black people, but this Black Lives Matter group and the new Black Panthers group and, oh, Farrakhan says all of these things that simply aren't true. You know, over the past 35 years in America, an estimated 30, no, I'm sorry, 324,000 black people have been killed at the hands of fellow black people. You know what? Racist white cops, they're the least of your worries, folks. Were you aware that in August 2015 alone, seven police officers were murdered by black people? They said they were going to go out and murder police officers, and they are. Police officers can't even get service to eat their dinner that they pay for because, it, this is an example, Pembroke, Pine, uh, Pembroke Pines, Florida. The Arby's there at Pembroke, uh, I think it's a mall there. The Arby's refused to serve a uniformed police officer because she's a police officer. What if they refuse to serve the police officer because she's a woman? Or what if they refuse to serve her because she's black? Or what if they refuse to serve her because she's gay? What has Barack Hussein Obama, you might be interested to know, what Barack Hussein Obama, the president of the United States of America, has said about the seven police officers murdered by black people in August? Uh, do you hear the crickets? He said nothing. Yet three black violent criminals die while committing crimes, and the president berates the police while sending high-level representatives to all of their funerals. You know, in Chicago, Illinois alone, there were 47 murders, 224 shootings, 187 non-fatal shootings last month. 93% of the victims were black. 96% of the shooters are black. Black lives matter. Apparently not to black people. Let me issue a challenge to you, America. How about we law-abiding white people, how about we do this? How about we just give this a quick try? Just because just we can. How about we law-abiding white people and we law-abiding black people, we come together, we grab our guns, and we stand in the gap for our law enforcement and for each other. You know what? If you aren't for us, you're against us. Blue lives matter. Good American lives matter. Violent thugs? No. You want to know something? Your life is worth less and less with each passing moment and with each violent crime you commit. To be silent is to be in favor of this racist violent. You must decide. You must resolve. And then you must stand.